Thank you, Angela. Well, today, Maryland's House Judiciary Panel will be working to close a major loophole in the ignition interlock drunk driving law, also known as NOAA's law, passed in 2016. WJZ has been in your corner following this bill. This morning, Miana Massey is live with the latest details. Miana, good morning to you. Good morning, Stefan and Cena. Well, lawmakers are really just working to make our roadways safer. So each year here in Maryland, impaired or drunk drivers make up for one third of traffic fatalities. And so advocates are really lobbying to tighten current legislation. And so you mentioned Noah's Law that was passed in 2016 in honor of fallen Montgomery County police officer Noah Loet Leoetta. Who was struck and killed by an impaired driver. The law requires those convicted of alcohol related driving offenses to have ignition interlock devices, commonly known as a breathalyzer, installed in their vehicle. However, there are several loopholes that lawmakers are now working to close. So, offenders with lower blood alcohol content levels, or those given what's called probation before judgment, which is often assigned to first timers to avoid a conviction, are not obligated to install. A breathalyzer. And stats show that in 2023 alone, most DUI and DWI offenders avoided this interlock mandate. This is because of those loopholes. And so a hearing is happening today in Annapolis to revise NOAA's laws. Of course, we will keep you updated. I'm Iana Massey reporting for WJZ.